Welcome to our channel. Today we're diving into why ground-based radio telescopes are often considered superior to their optical counterparts. We often think of telescopes as giant mirrors capturing visible light, but the electromagnetic spectrum is vast and radio telescopes see a whole other world. Get ready to expand your cosmic perspective as we uncover the advantages of radio astronomy. Let's explore why radio telescopes are essential for unraveling the mysteries of the universe. Let's face it folks, astronomy is at the mercy of the weather. Clear skies are precious to optical telescopes, but radio telescopes, they don't really care. Rain or shine, radio waves pierce through the clouds like they're not even there. Radio waves have much longer wavelengths, and they just barrel right through that atmospheric haze. This means radio astronomers can observe around the clock, regardless of the weather. No more waiting for that perfect clear night, they're collecting data 24-7, 365. Radio telescopes can even see through dust storms on Mars or the thick atmosphere of Venus. So advantage number one goes to radio telescopes for their all-weather capabilities. We've all been there stargazing on a beautiful summer night, but when it comes to optical astronomy, darkness is key. Sunlight completely washes out the faint light from distant stars and galaxies. Radio telescopes, they don't discriminate between day and night. They're tuned into radio waves and the sun doesn't drown out the radio signals from the rest of the universe. This means radio telescopes can observe continuously, gathering data whether the sun is up or down. This 24-7 operation significantly increases their observing time and allows them to track celestial events that might be missed during the day. So, score another one for radio telescopes. Their ability to operate day and night gives them a distinct advantage. Our atmosphere, while essential for life, is a bit of a nuisance for astronomers. It's constantly in motion, creating turbulence that distorts light passing through it. Optical telescopes suffer from this atmospheric blurring, limiting their resolution. To compensate, they often require complex and expensive adaptive optic systems. Radio waves, however, are much less affected by atmospheric turbulence. Their longer wavelengths glide through these atmospheric disturbances relatively unscathed. This means radio telescopes can achieve much sharper images without the need for sophisticated adaptive optics. So, while optical astronomers battle blurry images, radio astronomers enjoy a clearer view of the cosmos. The universe is a dusty place, literally. Interstellar space is filled with clouds of gas and dust that can obscure our view of distant objects. Visible light gets absorbed and scattered by these cosmic curtains, hiding entire regions of the universe from optical telescopes. Radio waves, however, have no problem penetrating these dusty veils. The longer wavelengths of radio waves cut through the dust, revealing what's hidden behind it. This ability is crucial for studying regions like the center of our galaxy, the Milky Way, which is shrouded in thick dust clouds. Optical telescopes can only see a fraction of what's happening there, but radio telescopes give us a front row seat to the action. So while optical telescopes are left peering through the cosmic haze, radio telescopes pierce the veil of dust and gas. We've talked a lot about visible light, but it's just a tiny sliver of the electromagnetic spectrum. Radio waves occupy a much larger portion of this spectrum, carrying a wealth of information about the universe. Think of it like this, imagine trying to understand a symphony while only listening to a single note. Radio astronomy opens up a whole new symphony of cosmic sounds, revealing phenomena hidden from our eyes. Pulsars, for example, are rapidly rotating neutron stars that emit beams of radiation, including radio waves. Then there's the cosmic microwave background radiation, the faint afterglow of the Big Bang. So, while optical telescopes provide stunning views of the visible universe, radio telescopes reveal the invisible forces and objects that shape our universe. In astronomy, size matters. The larger the telescope's collecting area, the more light it gathers and the fainter and more distant objects it can see, but building massive single-dish radio telescopes has its limits. That's where radio interferometry comes in. This technique combines signals from multiple smaller radio telescopes spread out over large distances, creating a virtual telescope with a diameter equal to the separation between the individual dishes. By combining their data, they can create an image as if they had a single telescope the size of the continent. This technique, called Very Long Baseline Interferometry VLBI, 
allows radio astronomers to achieve incredibly high resolution. It's like having a zoom lens for the universe. VLBI has revolutionized our understanding of distant galaxies, supermassive black holes, and the structure of the early universe. Astronomy is as much about data analysis as it is about observation. And in the digital age, radio astronomy has a distinct advantage. Radio telescopes are inherently digital instruments, capturing radio waves and converting them directly into digital signals that can be easily processed and analyzed using computers. This digital nature allows for sophisticated data processing techniques such as interferometry and pulsar timing. So, while optical astronomy is catching up in the digital realm, radio astronomy has been at the forefront of this technological revolution. The universe is not a peaceful place, it's teeming with energetic events and objects that emit radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum, including radio waves, and while optical telescopes excel at observing the thermal glow of stars and galaxies, radio telescopes are particularly adept at detecting non-thermal emission. This type of emission arises from processes that accelerate charged particles to incredibly high energies, such as supernova remnants and active galactic nuclei. Radio telescopes can map these magnetic fields and trace the paths of these energetic particles. They allow us to study the physics of black holes, the aftermath of stellar explosions, and the dynamics of galaxy clusters. So, while optical telescopes showcase the beauty of the luminous universe, radio telescopes unveil the hidden powerhouses. So there you have it folks, a glimpse into the amazing world of radio astronomy and why these ground-based giants often outshine their optical counterparts. From their all-weather capabilities and 24-7 operation, to their ability to see through dust and capture a wider range of the electromagnetic spectrum, radio telescopes provide a unique perspective on the cosmos. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the world of astronomy. See you next time.